in the house. All right. Strictly outside. I'm going to film this, by the way, because I want to get your reaction, all right? Because okay. it's kind of funny. I hope it's filming. I can't see what I'm filming. I don't know anything. So this is a video of Joe Biden that just came out today. I don't know if you've seen it. I but I, but since not. you have a kid, that's your kid, right? Yeah. You have a kid. All right. So tell me what you think he's doing here. Get ready. Distinguished guests. Please Trying to sit down? I don't the know. Lloyd J. What the hell is that? So after the event, he left early uh -huh. with Jill. He didn't stick around to say hello to the veterans. So Just people are saying he probably pooped his pants there. Oh, now remember, he's 81 yeah. years old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not insulting him because it's gonna happen to about 30% of us where you probably lose. Probably more than that. <laughs> right, I mean, it just, it's just the reality of aging. Yeah. But the reality is someone who does experience that should not be president. Oh, because yeah, if you're no. pooping your pants on the world stage. Listen, I think that, that anybody that that's, unless you're like really, really healthy and extremely competent, nobody right. that age should be right doing that yeah i mean it's pretty sad if that's the case yeah you know? definitely for sure do you think that joe biden's an embarrassment to this country yeah kind of. <laughs> <laughs> do you think we need donald trump back i do yeah and last question what would you say to donald trump if you could say anything to him i just think i have a lot of respect for him because he's the only one that's ever been president that actually gave up something to be president for us and he, they keep attacking him and taking everything from him that's right and he keeps going because yep. he's not giving up on us that's right he's like a uh, the lion on your shirt yeah that looks like donald trump to me <laughs> yeah right so your father left cuba yeah because when he was little they used to make him work in a like a sugar field yeah. and cut sugar cane in yeah. order to earn the right to go to school and then he said something about like 14 about not wanting to cut cane for castro for the rest of his life and he was arrested for it. So he ended up being a political prisoner for bad-mouthing Castro in Cuba and then came here with nothing and ended up becoming, like, worked in a lab, got a college degree. Wow. Like, all of that. That's an inspirational and story. So he just doesn't want to see it going back to that. And we're doing that now. We're yeah. at the political, uh, arresting political opponents phase of America right now. And you know yeah. what comes next is going to be assassinations of political opponents. I mean, it's a good thing they're not alive to see what's going on right now. Yeah, I mean, it's really sad. Really? I didn't think I'd see this in our lifetime. Do you think Trump's going to win? I think that if they have anything to do with it, no, because they're going to do whatever it takes to yeah. make sure he doesn't. So would you agree that we need, we need to make it too big to rig? Yeah. We need to stop the steal, right? Yeah. That's right. All right, guys, I'm just messing around with my GoPro. It has been inactive for about six months. I finally figured out how to make it work, so we're back on the GoPro temporarily. Um, but I just wanted to say, like, I, I just feel bad for Joe Biden. I really do think that this has reached the stage of elder abuse. You know, I've been reading a lot of comments online about his behavior in the video, and a lot of people are saying that it's either a sign of dementia, advanced dementia, by the way, or he has fetal incontinence. And a lot of people that have toddlers or, you know, elder parents that deal with that, they're saying that's what happened. The fact that he left the event early with Jill, that they kind of rushed off stage, I think is evidence that he might have pooped his pants. And again, I'm not saying this to make fun of the man. I just don't think an 81-year-old that has fetal incontinence should be president. We should have, if we're going to have an 81-year-old, then he should not be suffering from, you know, physical or, or mental disabilities like that. Democrats are so warped and deranged that they'd rather have that than a real man like Donald Trump. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Do you think Joe Biden pooped his pants? What are your thoughts? And by the way, later tonight, when it is cooler out, I will be interviewing more people about this topic. So this was the short version of the video. Expect a long one later today.